T129ATAK helicopter was delivered to the police. The first delivery of the T129ATAK attack and tactical reconnaissance helicopter produced by the Turkish Aerospace Industry, TASAS, was carried out to the General Directorate of Security with the project of the Presidential Defense Industry Presidency. The T129ATAK helicopter, which has a maximum cruise speed of 281 km per hour and a range of 537 km, can stay in the air for three hours. Equipped with a laser warning receiver and electronic warfare systems, the T129ATAK helicopters are used in areas where variability, showing the assault, armed reconnaissance, armed protection, deep attack, precision engagement, armed support, air defense systems destroyed, safety slash in built-up areas can take on combat roles. At the delivery ceremony, the chairman of the National Defense Commission of the Parliament and former Minister of National Defense Ismet Yilmaz, President of the Presidential Defense Industry Professor Dr. Ismail Demir, Police General Manager Mehmet Aktas, Turkish Aerospace Industry General Manager Professor Dr. Temel Kodil and officials attended. President of the Presidential Defense Industry Professor Dr. Ismail Demir, T-129 attack helicopter, Gendarmerie General Command and then the Directorate General of the Land Forces Command has entered into the inventory, noting that the delivery has been made recently helicopters played an active role in the operations of our security forces, have been a force multiplier with the talent they have. Within the scope of the ATAK project, which is a very important milestone in the establishment of helicopter industry infrastructure in our country, a large number of national equipment and weapons systems, especially the central mission computer, are being produced domestically, he said. Attack helicopters with ammunition and firepower of the operation today in the field of domestic smart active duty Demir said, ATAK helicopters in phase 2 configuration, along with electronic warfare against and the ability to measure the maximum level has been reached, the helicopter that was delivered to U.S. law enforcement agency within the framework of phase 2 we also are delivered. The defense industry was an industry that went towards maturation with various stages and steps, the attack was a joint work, a joint production. But when you use the step as a good ladder, you can gain important skills related to developing your own national helicopters, which TASUS is proud to do today. From this point of view, we also congratulate and expect the days when our national helicopters were completely realized with domestic production. Our goal is not only to build platforms, but also to develop subsystems and especially critical technologies locally and nationally. In particular, the concept we focus on is that we never tolerate foreign dependence in strategic and critical technologies. We are committed to this and will continue. For this reason, the work of our engine, the TS-1400, designed for the use of our helicopters, continues. Our next goal is to ensure its integration with our helicopters so that it can fly free and free in the sky, flying with domestic engines.